guys welcome back to another episode of going medieval so today i wanted to get some more of that wall built and we'll see if we can't uh get a couple extra things built i think there's going to be probably a raid soon too so we'll probably have that to deal with but um one step at a time just making sure everything's set up and ready to go for planting as soon as we get that done, we can start focusing on planting this. And yeah, I think that'll be good. Um, we'll have a little while to go until we get all that built. Just hoping that um, our people will be able to get to the thing if they're way out here doing tasks and stuff. Double checking some of these things. Last, uh, when I was editing, I was just, I didn't know if I left two spaces, and it looks like I did, so that's good. Alright, and just make sure that's over here as well. Yep, looks like it could. Alright, so it shouldn't take too, too long to build that, I don't think. Um, a little concerned, though, with the raids and stuff going to happen pretty soon that. We might not get all that done and might have some settlers out there um, hmm. you know what we could do is we could because the gates way over here right what we could do is make a ladder over here I guess somewhere centralized where there isn't any ramps going down they'd have to go down that way and then we could at least have somebody get up here. I think that might be wise. Tell them to build that. Can you actually build that? Just so there's something there, you know? So our settlers down here or whatever can get to it. Or if they're over here, then they'll be able to kind of run this way and then get up. Rather than have to go all this way over to here, especially if they spawn over here, then that would be really bad because then we'd have to board up the gate and then we have to get that all sorted out. But I don't know, one step at a time. Uh, once we get this basically built, it should be fine. Actually, the other thing that I have to consider is would they actually destroy it on the ground level? Maybe that's not such a wise idea. Because then they would be stuck down here where the bandits are.
All right, so our wall's mostly, well, the, the outline is mostly done. There's just this little section left to work on. And then I think there was, yeah, there's just this little part right here that we need to work on. Uh, but it's pretty much laid out, so we should be able to start filling it in. Um, we're on day four, so I'm kind of expecting a bandit insertion pretty soon. Um, I'm not sure when that will happen. There's a couple more wolves on the map that we need to take care of, though. Uh, there's uh, there was one somewhere around here, and there's a baby uh, sheep uh, that I'm trying to get tamed up. Uh, it's been over hanging around here. I've been trying to protect it from the uh, wildlife and stuff. Uh, that's why I went and hunted a bunch of wolves. There was a whole bunch of wolves hanging around there. I know there's one wolf over here. And I think there was a wolf that might have gone somewhere. I'm not sure where he went. But there's another one somewhere around here that we'll have to go hunt. I ended up just sending a whole big party after him. Like after the uh, original ones. We got quite a bit of them taken out last night, so hopefully we can do the same. I'm not sure where that wolf actually went. It's somewhere around here, I know he is. Okay, there's birds over there. Um, I'm not sure where he took off to. There's a fox up there. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, there he is. He's right there. All right. So we'll probably get a couple people to go to tend to that once we, well, we can get Sylvester and him maybe get these two guys and we'll get them over here. Andrew's pretty good at um, dealing damage as well. He, apparently, you can do melee hunting now. So he was actually coming out here and um, attacking the uh, wolves and stuff. I think he has like an axe or something. I'm not sure what he has on him. He has something steel. Great axe. So it deals 6.0 DPS damage per second all right so i i have uh, been telling them to garden and stuff too that's why i'm trying to leave the gardeners to do their thing uh looks like there's just a little bit more stuff that needs to be planted i'll probably be harvesting and stuff just waiting for these guys to get over there looks like they're
So we had that battle. I was figuring it was going to be sometime soon. Uh, we killed, I think, 11 of them. So we got quite a bit of people um, taken out. Uh, a couple people got severely injured, but uh, they'll make it through, no doubt. And uh, we got some extra armor and stuff, some better stuff. So we'll be able to um, start working towards that. But I've been trying to get them to slowly de deconstruct all this um, flooring and stuff. I'm, I'm taking it one step at a time so they can get most of this done. But I think they're wanting to do other tasks. Sylvester was pretty much our, our builder, so he's he's been uh, injured pretty badly. But he, he, he's already on a full path to recovery. He's only got some minor things so he's been tended to a couple times uh north got heavily hit i think and but he should be fine now by the looks of it he's gardening so yeah he's only a few uh a pierced cheek and pierced leg muscle so it wasn't like too hard but and then this person pierced cheek pierced arm muscle i mean we took out the archers eventually but they were <laughs> pretty consistent of shooting us uh they did manage to break down our first door but not the second one and we had a barrier behind the second one so they wouldn't have been able to break it completely anyways it was a close really close call though there was somebody building over here and they spawned right over in this area so they had to kind of run just in front of them and they did get back to the place just in time but i had sylvester already waiting at the door ready to uh barricade it up and everything like that so but yeah it was definitely interesting i think we need more um more of this we'll expand that a little bit more uh that's the uh warframe or warfare stockpile so they will um, move stuff from over out here to there, so hopefully that will help a little bit. And yeah, oh, we uh, got another donkey as well. So a uh, female, young, only three days old, these two. I'm thinking about getting a actual another barn set up just for the donkeys. Um, when we remove that, we might be able to put the barn over there, but uh, we have to remove all the pieces first. And... Just debating where we should like focus on other things like we might be able to fit something in here i'm not sure <laughs> Great, so I got the remaining of that building finally deconstructed, so we'll be able to put a barn or something on that side, I guess. Uh, I figure 
if we put it in this corner, we'll we won't uh, shade over the um, trees. Not sure what we'll put over here just yet, but um, we could put something, maybe a low story of something there, or even farm. Uh, we could probably slip in a small farm there. Um, possibly, I'm not sure. There's going to be a bridge that goes over on this side, uh, so might be able to fit something in between here. I'm not sure just yet, but it might be just a, like an outdoor area for the animals, possibly. Uh, we'll see what we can come up with. Um, some things like foxes and stuff can get in. So we'll have to be very careful of how we set this up. But um, giving that, we can probably build around here. I'm sure we can figure something out. Uh, it just might take a little bit of time to figure out how to set it up. And then we can start finally focusing on... Well, they'll, they'll probably be filling that in pretty soon. Uh, it's day seven, so we should be fine for the remaining of the spring to get that part finished. And then we'll start working on building the exterior wall up to this point, I think. And then we'll start focusing on that wall, and then this wall, and then finally that wall, and then all the way down to here. So I think that will be the plan at least, uh, just because the gates over here will be pretty important to get that part set up first. And they're almost finished mining out all this, so pretty soon we'll have to figure out how to add all the um, stuff. Now, I'm not sure if that goat ever or sheep ever got tamed. I don't think he has been. Hold on a second. Uh, 30. Okay, why are you not? He should be marked as tamed or taming, but... He wasn't for some reason, so I'll make sure I'll make sure that he's checked on there for some reason. I don't know why he was unchecked, but now they'll make sure to continue taming him for some reason. <laughs> I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, anyhow, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.